classify the obturator shown in the image below based on Aramani classification. Okay. So obturator as we know is a prosthesis for maxillary defects. A very common problem that either of us would make in this kind of a situation is to understand that these teeth are missing. But it is not the case. Here the teeth missing are these. Okay. So first quadrant anteriors, second quadrant anterior and posterior. So this is a defect that is including the entire second quadrant plus anterior teeth of the first quadrant. These are the teeth present. Don't confuse yourself with this. Look at the image carefully whenever such question is given, especially in uh, Aramani classification for maxillary defects, Cantor Curtis classification for mandibular defects, and Kennedy's classification for partially edentulous arches. Look at the teeth present and the missing clearly. Okay. Options are class 2, 3, 4, and 5. Now, this is a theoretical question. For that, we'll have to revise the classification. So, let's have a quick look at the classification. This classification given by Aramani. Some people like to call it Armani, but it's Aramani, even in the year 1978. Okay, Mohammed Aramani had given this classification six categories in total. This is class one. This is unilateral defect extending just up to the midline, including any one quadrant. Okay, that is a class one defect. Class two defect again is a unilateral defect not crossing the midline involving posterior teeth distal to the canine okay canine may or may not be absent so here posterior teeth and unilateral class 3 is a defect that includes only the palatal shell the remaining natural teeth are not affected okay so other teeth are present class 4 it's a bilateral defect, includes the midline, includes anterior teeth on one side, anterior and posterior teeth on the other side. So here the entire premaxilla is affected and the posterior part of one quadrant is affected. Okay. Then coming to class 5, it's a bilateral defect. I hope everyone is understanding unilateral and bilateral. Okay, bilateral defect. And here the posterior teeth are resected. No posterior teeth, only anterior teeth. Opposite of that is class 6, bilateral with anterior teeth missing and posterior teeth present. So in the given question, we have bilateral defect crossing the midline. All posterior of second quadrant are missing, anterior of first quadrant are missing. So coming back to the image, this is class 4, right? Same image in a clinical scenario. The obturator is this, right? These are the wires or struts to get retention for the acrylic. So the correct answer is class 4.